Welcome back to Fair Game. I'm Christine Leahy here with tennis star Jeannie Bouchard. It is time now for First and Ten. You ready to go? I'm ready. Okay. First time you posted something on Instagram, then instantly regretted it. Uh, one time I posted a picture of my younger brother in his uh, boxers when he was super young, and my mom was like, take that down. Oh. But it was cute. It was funny. It was funny, cute. Right? I post pictures of my little brothers, okay. and they don't get a say. Go talk to her after. <laughs> yeah, I will. First player you'd trust with a secret? Uh, Sloane Stevens. Okay. Yeah, uh, I love her, so I would tell her anything. Okay. First time you did something embarrassing on the court? Once I was on the court and uh, in a match, and I like I went down to serve, and I realized my skirt was on backwards. <laughs> but it, like it wasn't super obvious, but it threw me off, and then like I was a little bit distracted after that. No. Yeah. First player you'd want next to you in a zombie apocalypse? I would definitely say Serena. I feel like she would just destroy those zombies. Agree. First time someone slid in your DMs? Well, I'm not going to name names, but. <laughs> You know, as soon as I was on social media, I don't know, first time, like... Like a big, like a famous person. I mean, yeah, you know, it happens. Oh. First time you got nervous before a match? Probably the first match I ever played. I played my first tournament when I was eight years old, and I was super nervous, but then I killed the girls, so I got some confidence. Do you still get nervous? Yes, of course. I think it's good. It means yeah, you care. Yeah, nervous energy is exactly. good. Exactly. First time you got into an argument with a chair umpire or a line judge? I mean, that definitely happened probably as soon as I turned pro and we had, you know, umpires. Um, probably fighting over a line call, which we don't do now anymore because we have the challenge system. So that's probably saved a lot of arguments. First thing you'd do if you were invisible? I would uh, go stalk Cardi B. <laughs> yes! That's what I would do if I was invisible too. First thing you'd say if Richard Branson offered you a seat on his Virgin Space Shuttle? Yes. You would go? Of course. You're not scared to get launched into space? I trust him and his, <gasps> you know, technology. You like roller coasters, don't you? Yes. Okay. You don't? No. <laughs> okay. No, no. That, that idea scares me, I would say. No, thank you. First celebrity crush? Justin Bieber. Yeah. Um, He's Canadian. He is, yes. And I actually got asked... Uh, my first Australian Open where I did really well, who my, you know, celebrity crush was, and I said Justin Bieber. And then he, like, tweeted me after saying good luck for my next match, and, and uh, we ended up doing a charity event later on, so, like, it was, like, really cool. Did you go on a date with Justin Bieber? I'm not gonna spill that tea. What? But he's married now, so... Uh, he is. He <laughs> is married, but back then he wasn't. Back then he wasn't, no. I'm just gonna, in my mind, imagine that you went on a date with Justin Bieber. Okay, it's a good story. I like, I like it a lot. Coming up, we test Jeannie's knowledge of genies. Coming up, Christina Aguilera's first hit was... Jeannie in a bottle. When I walk on center court, they play it. What was Barbara Eden's signature move in I Dream of Jeannie? You don't have a clue what it is? No idea. It's this. That's next.